Hey guys, I'm Bradford James Jackson. I'm the writer-director of Come Back Home. And I am Nick Sharsak. I am the composer for the music <laughs> of Come Back Home. All the music featured in Come Back Home was originally composed by Nick himself. I think it was it was an interesting project for me because it was something it was the first time we worked together yeah. you know and I think the initial thought was that we wanted to maybe do something that wasn't too advancedly original but yeah. at the same time something that would be remembered started working together on it it was a bit of a, a bit of an interesting thing I think when, when it began because we didn't really know each other that well no you know, we, we didn't <laughs> even really meet you know when we first started working on it I think that after a while, you know, after five or six times talking on the phone, I think it was pretty evident that um, you had a very distinct approach to what you wanted to do musically. Yeah. But you didn't order me around to do what you wanted. You, you let me do, and as an artist, that's, I think, you know, you can relate to this, is that you, you of course, you need to follow direction, but you always want to be able to freely create. Nick didn't spend hours but days focusing on the music and making sure that every single note was perfect. Uh, the process for this film was, uh, was pretty much the same as I would normally approach the music. Um, because it is a period piece, uh, I wanted to make sure that there was enough uh, stylistic element of it that you could listen to the music and you would know exactly where it was. You would know that this is Scotland. You would get the scenery, but also with the, using the traditional instruments, the flutes and, and, and the, the Ewellian pipes and the bagpipe of ensembles and things like this. That was something that we wanted to use sparingly, but also wanted it to be present, especially in theme as well as within certain elements of, of the action to, to sort of enhance the drama, but also to tie the, the listener and the audience member into the story so that it's, it's cohesive and it's fluid. I think that working on scenes like this was, was very easy musically, but at the same time very draining emotionally because I really do invest a lot of emotional approach, you know, in time into you know, the thought and of the characters. And there's also a lot of things, there's, you know, piano in there, which is not necessarily a traditional thing. You wouldn't have had that in a maybe a score like this traditionally, but I feel that it adds a certain modernism to it. It adds a certain carry. and many long hours but you know it's kind of like two guys just hanging out drinking scotch and the yeah, right <laughs> Thank you.
<laughs> method, method acting. Method composing. Me method composing. Method composing. Yes, I'm going to coin that term. Yeah, officially. Officially. Oh, really awesome. Cool. Yeah. Well, cool. Well, hey, uh, from us to you, thank you so much for the support. Thank you so much for everything. And uh, we hope you'll be making more projects very soon. 